Hello everyone and welcome. In today's video, we're going to be going over the macros. So navigating to the macro tracker, you click on a client's name. Across these tabs at the top, you're going to click on macros. From here, you can see a lot of information. So starting out here on the left, you will have a weekly graph view of how well your clients are keeping track with their calories over the course of a week. Here, you can see all the calories and macros goal you've set for your clients. In the bottom left, you'll see the macro distribution of the protein, the carbs, and the fats. And you also have a totals by day, so each day it will update, and you'll, be, you'll also have an average there at the bottom of each macro and calories. To set macros for the clients, you can just click edit right here, adjust their macros and calories, you can add rest day macros, and you can also add macros for specific days of the week. We also have a macro calculator, calculator you can use for the clients to assign them their goals. With this feature, we do have integrations with MyFitnessPal and Chronometer. So your clients would log their foods in one of those two apps, and as they log more food, the macros and calories data will be updated throughout the day. If your clients use MyFitnessPal, we do have a link right here that will allow you to see exactly the foods they're tracking throughout the week, as you can see here. And then finally, in the settings, under the macros tab, you can turn on or off the feature to allow your clients to adjust their own goals for the macros and calories. Thank you all for watching. I hope this was helpful.